Jama John Sports Arts and Collectibles coming at you with a brand new video. How's everyone doing out there today in the YouTube universe? Well, this is a rare piece. There's no question about it. This is a, a oversized card cube with uh, filled with cards and I think a few packs from the 90s from different uh, different releases. Upper Deck. I see Leaf. I see this uh, this. Uh, Mattingly Ruth Gehrig card right there. That's from, I think, the uh, Babe Ruth Conlon collection. So uh, there's classic on the front here. So let's get this open. There's supposedly 800 cards in here. I'll try to go through them as fast as I can so you guys aren't you know, watching this and getting bored uh, through the process. So, But I'm really curious to see what the packs are. I think there's some McGuire cards in here too. So um, this, I definitely got this for a deal on eBay. And... Um, Yes, it was definitely a good deal. So I figured it was worth taking a chance. And I love opening up these kind of products. And for those of you who watch the channel and have been for years, know that. I love opening up these mystery type products because you never know what cards you're going to get out of these kind of products. So, and um, piece of plastic fell down there. I don't want the dog to get to that. Okay. Plastic wraps over there. Let's see if I can get this open. Oh, there's packs in here. All right. I see three packs, two packs. Um, I think it's two packs. Okay. Let's get these cards out first. I don't know how we're going to do this. We'll figure out this. Palmero, the classic blue. I'm not sure. That's from 91 classic. Or I think it's classic because I put that out. Might be something else. Another company. Anyway, let's get this card out. Hopefully... Okay, that's in really excellent shape. You know, this is like a five to ten dollar card, depending. Because the Mattingly, there's Sosa, base card from Upper Deck Collector's Choice. There's Bagwell. I think it's a second year Bagwell. And yeah, second year Bagwell. So it's not bad. Hall of Fame right there. And the other card is um, another Babe Ruth card here. And this is just from the general set. Okay, so there are those cards. Let's put those there. All right, let me see what I can do here. Let's start, I guess, uh, boy, oh boy, this is going to be difficult, huh? Let's try to get this going here. Let me pause this and try to pull some cards out. Hang tight. So the, there's another face card on the other side. That's this uh, another Babe Ruth card there. And then this is the card that was sitting, like, facing out. It's a Ray Lankford pinnacle. I mean, the card's in phenomenal shape. There's no question with that. Now, what will we get out of here? That's that's the question. I see a lot of Junk Wax era stuff. But I kind of knew that going into this, that this might be like that. So let's just see. Some 88 tops for Tolliver. Um, some upper decks. Some Dahmer, some 88. 88. Tops again. There's um, Eddie Murray and Calorcan Jr. Melito Perez from um, '94. Hmm. Okay. Let's keep going here. Let's just see if there's anything really good. We'll call them out. So let's just sit here naming everybody, which you can see what I'm showing at least. Let's look over the back, make sure that these are traded or update cards. Got an 84 Fleer, George uh, Frazier. Down goes Frazier, their stadium club, Lenny Dykstra. Kevin Bass, you got 87 um, Donruss Diamond Kings. So, um, Perez Steele did those, Dick Perez. So 87 Donner, Shane Raleigh. It's Bob Walk. Love Bob Walk. Okay, that, that's a card to add to the uh, goofy cards. And that's uh, Chris, or, sorry, Cecil Fielder. Put that aside. You'll probably see that in an upcoming um, video. All right, Don Sutton. There's another Hall of Famer from 87 Donruss. Upper Deck Dave Rigetti. I'll go through these later. Look at the backs. John Moses, 87. 
Don Rest, and that's a E6 tops. It's Gary Gary Ward, but I mean it is, and you know this is usually you can see a little bit of of a rough cup. But that's usually you know a, a six tops is usually a really horrific uh, set as far as conditioning goes, and uh, conditioning goes, and that seems to be pretty good. Neil Allen from eighty seven tops, and John Habian from eighty seven Don Rest, and got Todd Stottlemyre and Chris Bosio. Continuing on here. Jacob Brumfield from Leaf, 92 Leaf. Got the rookies, Joe McGrain. They must have had extras of, of him laying around because I've seen that card show up. In the, I, I think this might be a treat entertainment product. I'm not 100% sure because there's no uh, language on it anywhere in the cube. But it looks to be similar to that. That was Willie Wilson. Got Tom Brookins, 86 tops. Rex Hudler. Danny Jackson. Bobby Witt from 87 Fleer. Got a crown collection of Pacific. Matt Williams. Steve Decker, some score. Chris Hollis, that's OPG. Uh, Lloyd McClendon, there's a player. 88 tops. Mike Krukow. Ken Phillips, or Phelps, I'm sorry. No glasses in that one. 85 Donruss. Pedro Guerrero. It's all common so far. Another Hollis, Tom Browning. Pedro Guerrero. Andres Thomas, got an 83 Donruss. Ellen Nicely, Ken Oberkfell. Paul Quantrill, Collector's Choice. It's John Wayner, another one of our announcers. Pittsburgh boy right there. Warren Newsome, OPG, got an 890 Donruss there. Dennis Lamp, their OPG, Kelly Gruber. Kevin Hickey, 83 Donruss. Marty Bystrom, 86 Donruss. There is an 84 Donruss, Alfredo Griffin. It's kind of cool to see that in here. All right, Kim Batiste, rated rookie. Steve Jeltz, John Denny. Let's keep going here. Got a lot to go through. Which way are they going? This way. Okay, let's see. Francisco Cabrera. $90 to Joe Carter. Cal Daniels. Eddie Tobinsey. All common so far. Nothing jumping out here i thought maybe we'd see some rookies or something you know some like prospect type cards or something really cool because you tend to find those kind of cards in, in these kind of older products uh there's an 85 tops charlie lee brandt eric hansen uh, there's leaf peter hoy carlos garcia i think this is just a general Base. I don't think that's a special. It might be a blue foil, though. I'm not 100% sure. I'm going to put those aside just to check on them. And they're not worth a lot. There's Fred McGriff, Crime Dog. He's in the Hall of Famer. Um, Dave Eland. It's Leaf. And 91 Tops. Henry Cotto. Um, look out for the backs of these. If they're really dark, the Tops logo, those are actually variations, not errors. So I would go and look through your 91 tops. Uh, Francisco Cabrera again. Deion Sanders, all right. Early Deion Sanders card from 93 Fleer. Sandy Alomar Jr. Seeing a couple doubles here and there. Randy Johnson, 85 tops. Ken Phelps again with no glasses. I thought every card he had had him with glasses on. That's two two of those now. Archie C. and Fracco. It's a Hall of Famer, Alan Trammell. Nick Tartable. Another 86 tops in really good shape. Todd Morrell. Another one here, Ray Surridge. Our Pirates pitching coach. Oh, this is going to be a long video. Let's just try to go a little bit faster. Uh, that's Ed Sprague. 
Oh, I gotta love it. Pedro Munoz. That's going in the in the pile for to showcase in the goofy cards. Um, getting personal with a the bat there. Corey Snyder, and then we end with Dale Mahorchik of that little pile. Okay. It's Ken Phelps again. Dwight Dewey Evans. Seeing some doubles here. Dick Ruthven. 83 Donruss. Let's flip these around. Sorry, guys. Romero. No, Rojas. Joe Nolan, 83 dollars. Dave Concepcion, 86 dollars. Not a Hall of Fame, but a great player. Another guy who was a great player, but not in the Hall of Fame was Sweet Lou Whitaker. There's an 84 Donruss. Glenn Hoffman. Another Kim Batiste. Thanks for that. See, Jelts. I think that might be a double. There's, that is a leaf. Uh, Bill Russell. So the Canadian version of the 85 Donruss. Dan Gladden. Joe Girardi. Rookie prospect of Terry Wells. The rookies, Pat Howell. Not the rookies I'd like to see. Um, a dinged up 88 Donruss. Dave Hollins. There's Burt Blylove in Hall of Famer from 87 Donruss. Okay, that's the first one. That's down. Okay, so a lot of commons, a few Hall of Famers in, in there. But this came out, so I can. I think I can. There's a card here, too. Hold on. Who's that? Let's see who these packs are. Ooh, I think we're going to get something cool in here. Okay. It's weird that they cut it like that. There's the, uh, let's see who this is. Tim Cecil, my league card from Pro Cards. Okay, let's see what these packs are. There's a card down here too, and that is a Sports Flix. Um, Albi Lopez, but a lot of a lot of wear on the corner. Okay, let's see what these packs are. What is that? That is this is a weird. <laughs> that's a that is really strange. That's really odd. That's got to be an error or somebody opened this. That's got to be. And then we have a pack here of 96 Collector's Choice Series 1. All right, so at least we have something interesting to open up at the end. But that's weird. That's really weird. I wonder if that's a production error. That can't be. That has to be somebody open that up. Maybe I won't even touch that. That's a weird one. I'll have to look into it and see. All right, let's see. So 88 top starts us out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Nobody really of note in this pile so far. Uh, who the heck is that? Chris Holt, Pacific Paramount. Behind him is a Rico Bronia. I think those might be all foils. I don't think that's anything special. They may be wrong from that year of upper deck. So Mike Marshall from I think 91 Donruss. Donruss, excuse me, Bowman. There's Bip Roberts. John Jaha. No, maybe that is a foil. Because, um, whoops, let's just put these here. Not that that is worth anything, but let's just put it aside. I think that, let's double check it, it looks like a foil. Let's just double check it with this one. Ken Hill, yeah, so that, that's gotta be, um, oh, maybe not, no it is, I'm looking at the background here, so, sorry guys, I'm, I'm fixating on one particular car that is worth probably 15 cents. It's Hall of Famer Harold Baines. Dave Steve. I'll look through everything later on. Since we've got a lot to go through here. Okay. Let's see. Nothing really has jumped out so far. There's been no surprises. Just a few handful of Hall of Famers. That's it. The rookies have been pretty, pretty poor. 
and this kind of product. There's an 84 Dahmer Cecil Cooper. I want to go pull those all out too. At least those are cool. Steve Kemp. Probably the 86 is too. Let's, I'll go back and get those. There's Tony Pena, Garth Iorg. Floyd Yeomans. Okay, Dwayne Murphy and Andy Hawkins. Marty Cordova. Behind him, you have John Franco. I'll see if those, there's anything special about those. Another Mike Marshall. Sean Dunstan. Uh, Derek Bell, Operation Shutdown, the Yankees leaders. There's Ricky Henderson. It's a very common card. Boy, they just they just didn't they didn't shy away from the commons, did they, guys? <laughs> In this release. At least I think there was one release that I opened up. Probably last year, and it was awful, and uh, it had nothing but commons in there. I don't think there were any Hall of Famers at all. There's a Spike Owen from 84 Donners, and these are in really good shape. I mean, if anything, those are little little pluses out of this um, out of this uh, cube. There's Ray Miller, former Pirates pitching coach. So we've gotten two former Pirate pitching coaches in this cube. Right, does this come out? It does. Look at that. I don't have to pause. I can just take the slide the um the divider out and and there's a mark mcguire card so that's an upper deck let's see i think that's an insert it is it's like a 30 card might be a separate release or maybe it's a subset i'm not 100 sure but that's got a ding in it of course it does okay Let's see what we got in this one. Slide it over so everyone can see. All right, let's see. <clears throat> All right, there's, um, is that the error one? That might be the error card, I think. I think that is. So that's actually kind of cool. The outlier error card, I believe that's what that one is. So. And I said, this might be a Brady Anderson rookie. Let's leave old Brady in there. Um, Miguel Garcia and Randy Kramer from 87, I'm sorry, 89 Fleer. Scott Lewis. Dennis Old Cam Boyd. Matt Young, Joe Girardi. That is uh, Danny Schaefer. And this is like a, a top stadium club, like a team release, I believe. It's Tino Martinez. Marfil Santana. Mariana Duncan. Jack Clark. That's cool. That's, um, I believe that's, uh, what release is that from? Oh, Tops Archives. Billy Herman. R.J. Reynolds. Brian McCray Prospect. Steve Hecht, minor league card. The Indianapolis Indians. There's Juan Bell. Maurice Clayton. Okay. Cataray, Jim Corsi, a couple Bob Welches in a row, Floyd Yeomans, right a rookie of Ben McDonald. And that's from 90 Dars along with the Diamond Kings. So you've got Bobby Bow and Bonds in the team leaders card from 88 Tops. 
Uh, Joe Girardi. I don't think that's a rookie. Bo Aldred. Tony Armas, decent player right there. Bill Wigman. There's Bo Jackson. Okay. Overproduced year, but I love that year of Fleer. So Bo Nose. Okay. Butch Henry from that. Um, David Cohn Starstruck. I don't think that is a... That's part of the set. Um, but uh, that's, again, the the uh, this one here is from the uh, Stadium Club team release. So there's score. I don't think Starstruck. I want to put that aside just to make sure, but I don't think that's that's an insert. Maybe it is. Um, but even though the number's on there, or it might be considered a subset. I don't know. So these 90s releases were kind of strange. There's Sweet Lou Whitaker again. But that time was score. Eddie Zosky. <laughs> uh, Vinny Castilla from Pinnacle. Daryl Strawberry, 94 Donruss. Another R.J. Reynolds. Jimmy Kramers. Kramers. Kramers from the Indianapolis Indians. His pre-rookie card. Okay. Getting some doubles. To Kelly. And ben McDonald. Then we got two regular rookies. Followed by Lee Guterman. Followed by Willie Green, his first round draft pick card. Our first round pick card from 90 score. Thank goodness I didn't pay a lot for this. Randy Bush. Another of one of the Team Rockies cards. That's Eric Wedge. Osvaldo Fernandez. Pinnacle. Tom Foley. There's Rick Roden, former Pittsburgh Pirate pitcher there with the Yankees and a checklist. All right, last part of this one. Kevin Stalker. Bill Swift. There is a Howard Battle rookie. From Sport Flicks. Uh, Lenny Harris from 93 Fleer. Here is Dave Masters, another pre rookie with the Indianapolis Indians. Some doubles, a couple Eric Hansons, we've got maybe even three. That's our third Royce Clayton, Juan Neves. It's like a yak pack, yak pack cube. <laughs> All right, there is the end of that one. Okay, let's try to go faster now. Let's try to move a little quicker. All right, so. And the face card here is, I think, Mike Morgan. And that is uh, Flair. With a dinged up corner right there. Not that that's worth anything, really. But, yeah, you know, I must have got banged around over, over the years, whoever had this. Jay Bell. Sam Horn. Dean Palmer. Some rookie prospects. Well, one right here. Jim Austin. Another rookie this time. You've got Luis De Los Santos. It's Julio Franco from uh, the score release. All right, 91 Flair would not be complete without that. There's Rance Molinix. There is an 84 Tops Lloyd Mosby. Let's leave him in there for now. Gus Polidor. 88 tops. Oh, boy. One of my least favorite releases. 95 Fleer. Woody Williams. I love Mike Morgan. 
too in this, it looks like. There's an 86 Fleer, Mike Mason, and then Vince Law and Bob Stanley. Steve Finley. Matt Noakes. Mike Bilecki. Paul Sorrento. Is that a rookie? Oh, with a, with a, something really bad on the back there. Something stuck to it. There's Rick Reed. From 91, or 90 Leaf, sorry. Jose Melendez, rookie prospect card. Jim, o Jim Austin, again, thank you for that one. His rookie prospect card. Appreciate it, Cube. All right. Todd Stottlemyer. It's Ricky Henderson. Okay. Almost done with this one. Another Lloyd Mosby. Ron Kittle. Deion James. This time we've got John Olerud from 95 Fleer. Bruce Bochy. There is a player. Dale Murphy. Not in the hall. There's an Otis Nixon looking kind of mean. And then Bob Stanley. I think Bob Stanley showed up a lot in this too. It's just definitely like a yak cube. All right. Heathcliff Slocum. Reggie Sanders ready to rookie. There's another. I think this has got to be the regular base. I'll put him aside. I don't know. Oh, that flare. But that was, uh, that was um, Carlos Garcia. Sorry. Mike Felder. Will, Will the Thrill Clark. Carlos Baerga. Another Jim Austin. Three of them now. Four of them. Hensley Mullins. Jeez. Well, at least at least we're, this is interesting, you know, because, I, you know, this is not the kind of product you see around. And, you know, like I said, it was so cheap. I'm like, I got to take a chance on this. And we sold the packs, dude. I'm debating if I should open up that Topps pack. Or not. Uh, George Orta. Um, I might not open that up and just see if it is a um, something special. And if not, come back. You know, come back and open up and let you guys know regardless. Uh, all right. So I missed a couple of players there. Sorry about that. With this, you got Dave Stewart, 95 Fleer. A bunch of Blue Jays. Probably just grabbing team sets, throwing them in here. Another Dale Murphy. Bert, Bert, Bert Hooten, excuse me. That's a Bobby Thigpen rookie. Another Bob Stanley, Will Cordero, Eric Hansen. All right, that was the end of that one. Dan Howard, I think we got him a bunch of times too. All right, last part of the cube. And I'll pause it and look this tops pack up and make sure that it's not some production error. And if it isn't, then we'll open that up along with the other one. That sounds like a plan. All right, let's see what else we have here. Here are the rest of the cards and the face card. And this side was another one of these Babe Ruth cards that, you know, aren't really worth anything, but they're they're good for baseball history, nostalgia elements. Um, so there's that. Okay, let's see what's left. This was the other one, I believe. This card here, Robin Ventura. Okay. All right, let's see what we got here. Another Robin Ventura. Wow, this is long. Okay. Let's look at the timer. Robin Ventura. Try to go through these quick. Lee Banks. Craig Biggio. All right. Whoops, sorry. I'm going to bump the camera there. Hall of Famer Craig Biggio. Jim Corsi. That's our third one, possibly, with that release. Todd Van Poppel. Wouldn't be complete without a Todd Van Poppel card. There's Junior Ortiz, Mike Boddicker, and Terry Bross. Okay, continuing on, Danny Tartable, uh, all-star card. I think that, I don't know if that's from the actual set, if that's something, like a subset, not sure. 92 Donruss. There's a, this is a, actually a release from a release, Donruss, like, complete set really no it's something else it's i can't remember the name of it if you guys know please comment down below but they're blue border cards and they're actually pretty cool tony pena 
John Crock. Saying he's okay there. You've got a Wally Whitehurst. Pinnacle. Boy, they could have given us one excellent rookie. I guess we did get the Al Lighter error. I believe it's an error. But Blylevin from 91 Fleer. That's a Hall of Famer. It's Chris Gwynn and Ken Howell from 87 Donruss. All right. Another Todd Stottlemyre. I love Todd Stottlemyre, too. Jerry Don Gleaton. Mike Flanagan. Let's see, Michael Brantley. All right, Roberto Alomar, Hall of Famer, not a, not the greatest guy in the world. Is a Ron Gant uh, from that Donruss release from nineteen ninety. Okay. Let's see what we got. Where do they flip around? Let's find out. Goodness gracious. All right, here we go. What is this? This is Showtime. And who is that? Brian Hunter. Is that an insert? I'll check on those and see. It's not an insert, but it might be, like I said, a, a subset. J.P. Phillips. J.R. Phillips, okay. Okay, from 95 Select. That was exciting. <laughs> Joe Carter. Delano De Shields. All right, we're almost done. Almost 30 minutes in. This is a long video, guys. This is an epic long video. Jim Edmonds. Some doubles. This is Brett Saberhagen. Another Jim Corsi. Good Lord. Jack Morris Hall of Famer. Hair's looking, is that? No, that's the guy behind him. I don't think that's his hair. I think it is. Jack Morris is sports, rocking some uh, hair metal hair there. I'm not sure. Or was that the guy behind? Might be the guy behind, the player behind him. Uh, Patrick Lennon, star rookie. Thank you for that one. Greatly appreciate it. Jamie Moyer. It's a Hector Fajardo. Monty Ferris. Sounds like a game show host. I think I've said that before, too. That Gerald Perry, Dave Parker, another Jim Corsi. Good Lord, that's like four or five now on that one. Come on. <laughs> Teddy Walling, Greg Brock, Tom Candiotti. Uh, let's see if there's anything else super cool on here. It doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. I've already used that one in the Goofy Card video, so that stays in the pile. You got a Chris Jones from the Team Rockies release. Mark Leiter, Jerry Don Gleaton, Mario Soto, and our last two cards are Colin Castillo and BJ Serhoff. Let me pause this real quick. Um, we're going to come back, and we're going to open up these packs, and uh, I'm going to see if this is just an error or somebody resealed this. It looks like, I don't know. It's just really weird. All right, okay. hang tight, guys. So I'm going to leave this one alone. And the reason I'm going to leave this one alone is because it, it's it's hard to tell. It looks like it was not resealed. It looks like it was actually a, a, an error on the, I don't know. It doesn't look, I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I do see something here. I don't know. I'm going to leave this alone. I might even take this to my LCS and have them look at it and see if they think it's something weird. Because, you know, sometimes errors like this, if they're like, you know, one of a kind, um, that they could actually hold a lot of value. So I'm not even messing with that one right now. So let's go open up this. This will end the video here. 1996 Upper Deck Collector's Choice Series 1. Okay. And uh, let's just wrap this one up with this pack. And hopefully we'll get something good out of it. You never know. Maybe this will be the, uh, the saving grace. We did get a silver signature here. That's a cool one. Stat leaders. Randy Johnson and Hideo Nomo. The cards, are they in good shape? Pretty good. They might have a little spec ding down there. Let's see what we get. Another silver signature, this time of Tino Martinez. It's not bad. You got a Mark McGuire. I think this is like an insert game, like a, a game card for uh, yeah, interactive cards. Play. So, uh, Mark McGuire. Let's see what the rest of these cards are. Alex Gonzalez. Andy Pettit. Uh, Chad Curtis. Steve Paris, Joe Nunnally, 
Got a rookie class here, Chanho Park. Okay, I'll take that. And our last card is Traditional Threads. And um, I think that, I wonder if that's part of the uh, set. Frank Thomas, Hall of Famer. So, you know, that was kind of the saving grace at the end. And, um, you know, this, this wasn't the greatest, but it wasn't the worst either. So, um, I'll just kind of put these cards up here. I like the, uh, I do like the Chan Ho Park um, rookie. That's kind of cool. That's part of the set too, I believe, I think. So we got a lot of rookies. I mean, got a lot of worthless rookies, but we did get some, a lot of Hall of Famers. Let me see if how many are here. I think I got them all. And uh, did get an interesting, I think that's the LA error. I think that's the error card. Get a handful of Hall of Famers, not a ton. Just a few Hall of Famers right here. We're not going to go through all those. Uh, these are all, I think, either parallels. There's some mixture of different um, cards here. I don't think these are inserts. I have to double check. And we did get um, the Bo Jackson uh, from '89 Fleer, the, the Lone McGuire car, which they promoted on the uh, on the uh, cube part and then uh there were there were some 80, 84 dollars and some older 80s uh vintage cards in there and that's it guys so this this was interesting oh, i might as well put this card up there too where did i put it this mattingly and ruth and um garrett card which still does does hold a little bit of value so if anything you know i'm not looking i wasn't looking to make you know Looking to, uh, to take these cards and put them up, up for sale in the store at all. I was just looking to do something cool with this opening. So there you go, guys. Um, this was some fun, and hopefully you enjoyed it. And that's all I've got for you guys today. So remember to like, subscribe, comment down below. Share this video with your friends. Send me a loved ones. The eBay store link is down below in the description. Until next time, folks, this is John and John Sports. I'm Collectible signing off, and I will see everybody very, very soon.